We're excited to introduce the brand new library in Serato DJ Pro and Serato DJ Lite 4.0. We're going to walk you through many of the new features that should help create an efficient workflow for you when DJing or simply preparing to do so. To get started, make sure you have downloaded the latest version of Serato DJ Pro or Lite from serato.com. You'll need version 4.0 or later. Open Serato DJ Pro and let your DJ library automatically import. Depending on the size of your library, this may take some time upon launching for the first time. Once your library is fully imported, the load time will be significantly faster when opening Serato DJ Pro. We now have a new track rating feature that allows you to rate the songs in your library with 1 to 5 stars. These ratings can also be imported from your Apple Music library and will appear in the new rating column, which can also be customized with emojis if you choose. Please note that country flags are not available on Windows machines due to operating system limitations. You can now quickly find crates you're looking for using the new crate search function. This is a much faster way to navigate your list of crates and jump straight to the one you're searching for. This is a feature that is exclusively in Serato DJ Pro, so if you're using Serato DJ Lite, this will require an upgrade. You can also customize the color of your crate by right-clicking and choosing from the color palette here. There is now the ability to create a shortcut to specific go-to crates and pin them to the top of your library for quick access. You can do this by right-clicking and choosing the Favorite Crate option here. You can favorite multiple crates and arrange them in any order you like. When you're done with those crates, you can simply remove them from your favorites like this. If you have a specific track in your library and you're curious about what crate it lives in, there is now the option to Show In Crates, which will present a list of crates the particular song lives in. This will also apply to songs in streaming playlists. Changing the sorting of your crates is now easier than ever. Sort them in the order that best suits you, from custom to alphabetical or by the date you created it. But please note, the date created sorting will only apply to crates created in 4.0 or later. There is a new layout option available for the files, prepare, and history panels. You can now click this button here to utilize a vertical view of this panel or simply change it back to the traditional horizontal view. Speed up the time it takes to prepare your sets by instantly knowing how many tracks, the total time, and actual size of your crate now displayed in the status bar at the bottom of your screen. If you need to make a crate of songs to play for, say, a 45-minute set, you can easily do this and keep track of the runtime of the entire crate. For those of you who are using both local files to DJ with and streaming files, these can now be combined into one crate. You can browse and play both file types all in one place. And album art just got a lot more flexible. It can be resized in your library by stretching the column like this. Zoom in for more detail or shrink it to keep your view clean and compact. Your Serato DJ library will now analyze on import. So if you have this option checked, details such as BPM and key will be added automatically when adding your new files to the library. This analysis will continue even while connected to hardware. This means you no longer have to disconnect to batch analyze your tracks. We hope this video helps your process of organization and library management in Serato DJ Pro. Have fun playing music and feel free to check back with us for future updates.